welcome to Leicester. This is our city and we want to tell you a bit more about it. A city known for its culture and diversity. But did you know it boasts a history going back 2,000 years? Young people and history don't usually mix, but we're going to take you on a journey to one of our oldest streets, Churchgate. Churchgate. Not much is known about the early history, but we discovered that it's one of the oldest streets in Leicester and its name probably dates back to Danelaw. The word garter means road in Danish, and we found out there was a church based on the street in the mid 7th to late 9th century. Put it all together and you've got Churchgate. It looks a bit hidden, but it has so much street character, and a small traditional pub, the Salmon, is one of the only features on it now. We all know what a bus is, however, in this case, we're talking about Buckclose Lane, situated just off Churchgate. A great name for a street in a young person's mind, but it's named that for a reason. A butt is an archery shooting field with mounds of earth used for targets. Originally, the name referred to the actual targets, but then became the platform that held the targets. In the 16th century, Elizabeth I donated an area of open land to the Freemen of Leicester for archery purposes. In this area, butts, or shooting marks, were set up for the archers to use during their practice. Those who didn't practice were forced to pay penalties. The Fish and Court. This was a really popular pub that dates back to 1832 and was the work of architect Henry Goddard from the famous Goddard dynasty responsible for several magnificent buildings, including the clock tower. It was one of the first pubs to have a TV screen and we bet this pulled in loads of customers. They even had some huge stables stretching to the back of Belgrave Gate that accommodated the animals which performed at the Palace Music Hall in Belgrave Gate. In 1949, they even had a load of elephants in them. Imagine that. 1966, this pub became one of Leicester's three Bernie Inns, where Black Forest Gatto, steak and prawn cocktails were all washed down with a few pints of pedigree, a real treat. Word has it that a large amount of fish from the fish and court was restored, remounted and continued to be displayed for a few years at the Bernie Inn. Alas, the pub closed its doors in 1980 and turned into a nightclub. Over the years, Churchgate became a hotspot for nightclubs. This changed the way people saw the street leading to a negative perspective on the safety of the area. It had suffered and soon became a street neglected by the city of Leicester. 21st century Churchgate has a bright and prosperous future. New small businesses are opening which reach the needs of our numerous cultural communities. Residential and business owners have been consulted by the council and the voluntary sector agencies to assist economic regeneration and prosperity. Here's to the next few centuries as new history and stories are made in this great and historic street.